Today we're looking at some steering dampers or steering stabilizers like you often see on four-wheel drive pickups and so forth but our concern is air-cooled Volkswagen and for a long time was having a severe death wobble issue with the steering that seemed to be on the verge of breaking the steering or just shaking the car apart and chased a number of solutions only to meet with disappointment. So for reference, here's a stock Volkswagen steering damper. And it's mounted with the reservoir a little higher than the operating rod. So as the steering goes back and forth, it extends and retracts, much as I'm doing now. And there's a mild amount of resistance applied. So in combating this death wobble issue I had, I turned to the aftermarket and from eBay I got this Trail Boss steering damper and I also got this Rancho suspension steering damper. And I first tried the Trail Boss. Both of these are for a Ford Bronco application originally. And I cobbled together this uh, somewhat crude adaptation here. You can see how it would take the place of that. And at this end, I had to weld a bracket onto the suspension, which was a significant investment of energy to create a bracket to hold this on the car and then it connects to the steering. Well I continued to have the death wobble issue and I never considered that this was contributing to it not solving the problem. But I finally had to accept that as you can see here if this is mounted with the reservoir high and the operating rod low, it quickly develops a dead spot. And simply changing back to the stock damper was a tremendous improvement. Though this looks big and strong, in fact, it can't be installed reservoir high. Now reading the instructions, there's no warning not to install it with the reservoir higher than the operating rod and even in the picture it seems to be about level and if you ever to drive on a side slope you probably get that same problem I just illustrated. And I actually thought for the sake of science, I would try this even bigger Rancho steering damper. Again, it's meant for a Bronco application. And I note the number on it, it's a RS5402. My suspicion is that this is an ordinary shock absorber that they're selling as a steering stabilizer. Again, in the, in the installation instructions, it appears to be about vertical, maybe with the reservoir a little bit down, but no warning here that you can't mount it reservoir up. This picture says it all. You can see the reservoir is much lower than the operating rod, but in the words, again, no warning about installing it reservoir high. This one did come with some nice mounting fasteners and a decal and I was going to make another adapter like I had here and experiment with using this even more husky one 
But to my chagrin, I was easily able to see that it's got a huge dead spot if it's mounted reservoir high. So, I see no point in installing this. I'm sure I'll be back in death wobble country if I substitute this giant one for this tiny one. Now maybe someone watching this video can point me in the direction of something heavy duty that will work in any orientation. I would like to get some return on the bracket I installed on the car but for now only the stock damper is proven capable of stopping the death wobble. So in conclusion Again, here's the stalker. Here's this trail boss. Here's the rancho. And these two did not work if they're mounted with the reservoir slightly higher than the operating rod. Appreciate any constructive comments or advice here. I am still looking for one of this form factor that will work on the Volkswagen. Thanks and be sure and watch my other videos.